Hi, Stan with 3D PT. So I was inspired recently by the hammer that Jeremy Schmidt, and I'll include a link in his channel, uh, carved with a three with a CNC router. And I really wanted to test the limits of what the PLAs and commercial plastics of 3D printing could produce. And so um, I looked at his design and his SVG file. I'll include a link to Jeremy Schmidt's channel below. And I was inspired to produce my own 3D printed mallet. So this is completely printed with uh, ColorFab PLA PHA. Um, and I have some different colors here. This one is ultraviolet, so actually if I take it outside, it'll turn purple. Yeah, because we all need a purple hammer. Um, designed in AutoCAD 2014 as well as Tinkercad for the logo. The caps here are made with, uh, this is Ninja Flex and Semi Flex. Inside the hammer, uh, it sounds like a rattler. There's about two dozen flat washers to provide the dead blow weight. And for these, these are rivets that I put into the file itself. Um, so I could use three millimeter uh, filament as a rivet to provide cross support. And for the handle, um, I printed in two pieces. And I use a soldering iron to uh, flat weld the seam together. And it's glued together with super glue. And so I did just test this out. And I was very excited because it not only did it survive, um, it started a nail just like it was supposed to. So. So first test is a nail straight into the board. I'm going to use the semi-flex side in. And the inside of the hammer is okay. Even the pad's okay. So it all looks good. So there's not even a scratch on the head of the hammer. Pad's looking good. So that was one of the biggest uh, deck nails I could find. I'm gonna go down size a little bit. Let's see here. No cracks so far on the hammerhead. Oh man, this is going good. Okay, last one is going to be a finishing nail.
So I'll glue on the pads later. Let's try that again. Again, no cracking in the hammerhead. Pads have a little bit of damage, so. So 3D print them out, I'll call it a success, because it did uh, drive in the nails um, into a very heavy pine board. So um, I'm going to hold off on the files just now, may post them later, um, but keep your eye on 3dpt.club as well as 3D3dprinterchat.com.